All right. And let's just make sure we're live. Wow. Okay, unstable. What's up with that? I want to make sure everything's all good. Don't need any weird bufferings. Don't got that intense music all because of that, uh, <laughs> that fallen mirror. All right, we're, 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 we're better. Okay. Anyway, we are... <laughs> we're in the lovely town of Medeal, um, where I'm again not remembering anything. Got our plane parked over there. Right, let's check it out. We said hello to this old man when we came in, so I'm not going to bother with that. Is this a store? Y'all got any of them things? Welcome! We always welcome ta cash now about where you want to go. I'm afraid our customers have already booked it up. There's nothing left. Just kidding. It's just a little joke. Now what can I do for you? Nothing. Because you don't have anything that I want. You come again. What's wrong? You sure are friendly all of a sudden. Also, that's it. You want the Mimet Green? You want the Mimet Greens, don't you? Yeah, give it some. Oh, okay. Here, go ahead and eat. Sweet <laughs> Mimet. Chocobo looks like it enjoys eating the greens. <laughs> How cute. I just want to tickle him. Tickle his feet, tickle his stomach, tickle his neck, tickle his belly, tickle behind his ears, tickle under his arms. Weird. All right. Look at the weapon store with the chocolate load. First you need to find some Mimet Greens. Tickle behind its ears. Tickle behind its ears. <laughs> receive choco re receive materia from the chocobo. So that overgrown moon's gonna fall on us, huh? This is no joke! We gotta start stocking up on supplies before they're all gone. Out of the way! Hey, move it! Move it! Person's moving like they're on crack. <laughs> I'll just like, put on the uh, fast forward and make it even worse. Huh? Never seen you here before. You from out of town? How are things on the outside? Between the earthquakes and meteor. It just might be the end of the world. Just like everyone's been saying. Oh, how depressing. What a miserable world this is. <clears throat> oh my god. In here too? You again? You aren't hoarding up goods too, are you? Don't reach in front of me. Everything in this store is mine. I got money to burn. I've been saving like mad just for times like this. Come on out of the way. Move, will you? Move. Chocobos ignore humans who don't look like they'll give them greens. Huh. 
Welcome. Cash is welcome here. How can I help you? You have things that I don't. <coughs> so I'll take that, uh, those new materials, please. What's the matter? Are you all alone? You got lost, didn't you? Separated from someone you love? Silly thing. I guess it's been about a week now since he washed up here on the shore. Poor pokey-headed young thing. It's really sad, but weird. He was holding this really long sword. I don't know, the whole thing feels unlucky to me. The amazing thing was those, was those weird blue eyes. What? Wait a minute, what did, you, what did you just say? Excuse me, that person you were talking about. It sounds like... It sounds like Cloud. Yeah, villager found him a little way down the coast. It was about a week ago, I think. Poor kid, must have drifted from somewhere pretty far away. Cloud, it must be, it's Cloud! <laughs> Good job, Tifa. You found him. So where is he? Is he safe? Where is he now? Yeah, up ahead here at the, at the uh, clinic. He's alive? Cloud. Cloud's alive! Cloud! Not Cloud? Cloud? Hey, you barged in here like Meteor was crashing down or something. Oh, 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 oh. Just a little doctor humor for you. I'm sorry, but I heard a friend of mine was here. A friend? Oh, the young fellow. Don't worry, he's next door, but his condition isn't good. Here? Over here? Cloud? Oh, Cloud, I'm so glad you're safe. You look like you'll never walk again. Huh? Cloud? Ugh. Uh, what's wrong, Cloud? <laughs> Cloud, what happened to you? Mako poisoning, quite an advanced case. It appears this young man's been exposed to high levels of Mako energy for an extended period of time. He probably has no idea who or where he is now. Poor fellow. Can't even speak. He's literally miles away from us. Someplace far away where no one's ever been. All alone. Doctor! Damn, that's evil. Cloud. <clears throat> uh, let's excuse ourselves. <laughs> Listen, real mind waiting outside. I actually really like the doctor's face for some reason. What do you want me to do? Please, Cloud, talk to me. Tell me you see me. Tell me you can hear me. Tell me, please. I made it this far believing in the mem memories we shared. This isn't happening. It's too cruel. Oh, Cloud, I...
Listen, Doc, why don't you tell us the truth? What about Cloud? Is he all right? I'll say it again. He's got Mako poisoning. I've never seen a case this bad. An immense amount of Mako drenched knowledge is infused into his brain. It's a miracle he survived. No normal human could have. No wonder. After all, he fell into the life stream and was carried down here. But remember, the light of hope can be found anywhere. If you give up hope, what will happen to him? Hope. I guess that's all that's left now. <sighs> you okay? Yes. I'm sorry to worry you all. There's something I want to say to you. I'm in love with Cloud. I'm marrying him right now. I don't care about anything else. Only Cloud. I want to be by his side. These tits stay with him. <laughs> yeah, right. Hang in there, Tifa. Do what you wish. I'm sorry. Everyone, especially now. Don't worry. I'll stop by again. Take care of him. Take good care of that boy. Right. Now we gotta be heading back to the high wind. Uh, I didn't stop by the weapon shop. What are we gonna do now? What can we do? Huh? Ain't there nothing we can do? And don't go tell him us to wait for Cloud to get better. Oh, I've got some news. Yeah, what? That you a spy? Yeah, I already, I've already told you I was. Both Gya ha, ha, ha and Gya ha, ha, ha are up to something. Wanna eavesdrop? Now then, we're faced with two issues. One, destroy Meteor. Two, remove the barrier around North Cave and defeat Sephiroth. Any ideas? <laughs> yeah. The first problem's already solved. Meteor will soon be smashed to bits. The plan is already in motion. We are collecting huge materia from each region. What? Huge materia is a high density special type of materia made through a special compression process in Mako reactors. The energy extracted from it is 330 times the strength of normal materia. Yeah. <laughs> How about that? We will gather all the huge materia together and ram it in a meteor. That will cause a huge explosion, reducing Meteor literally to bits. You're going to ram Meteor? Do you think we have the technology to do it? First things first. Right now we've got to collect the huge materia from each area. We've already collected the materia from Nibelheim. All that's left are Corell and Fort Condor. I've already dispatched troops to Corel. Yeah. Corel. What else can they do to the Corel? And the huge materia. You mean the huge materia, don't you? I've heard about it. <clears throat> when our small materia nears the larger one, there should be some reaction. I'm certain of it. <clears throat> That's why they're using the materia power in our. Our, that's why we're using the materia power in our fight. Can't let Shinra get a hold of the huge materia. Besides, when Cloud gets back, I want to show him this huge materia. He's going to be shocked. <laughs> going to shock him. So what are you saying, Baron? Even though you're always knocking him, you really want Cloud to return? To return? I ain't saying nothing about nothing. 
So just shut your face. Every group's got to have a leader. And that's me. Or at least want to be. But I ain't cut out to be no leader. I never knew this knew that till lately. <clears throat> that's what it is. <laughs> hmm? What? What's going on? You've been chosen to be the new leader. Pain in the ass. Forget it. But for us to fight, we gotta have Highwind and you. We needed to save the planet. And who's running this ship? You? That's why you're a new leader. Hey, no one else can do it. Mm -mm. Uh, ship's gonna save the planet, huh? Ain't that gonna be just a little tough? Oh man, stab me in the heart. I'm a man too! Okay, I'll do it! Everyone, follow me! Alright, now here's the first job. The operation room's waiting for you. Yeah! I want to go back to Nadil. Oh, he's level five now. <laughs> Congrats on becoming our cat, our leader, Captain. Yo, leader man, get your pilot ass up here. Looks like you turned out to be the leader after all, Captain. Huh, the huge material is at Corel Fort Condor, and I'm sure there was another place that had it. Where was that? <coughs> Sid. Let's visit Clown and Tifa from time to time. Sid, I wish I had your go get them attitude. What the fuck? I got like cat hair all over me today. It appears my feelings vanished into thin air ever since my long slumber. Alright, I can't fly yet. I gotta do something to make it so I can, apparently. Yo, Sid! When you're ready, we're, we're heading for the Corel reactor. Come on, leader man, let's hurry! Sid? I know you're all dying to talk to a babe like me, but... Just leave me alone. This shit makes me... Urgh. <sighs> All right, I think I'm going to take Yuffie and Barret. Let me fly now? Okay. <laughs> Good. I got a feeling something bad is going to happen. Is everything going to be okay? I'm alright. I lived a long, full life. But I'm worried about my son and his family living in that far-off town. I hope they're safe. Wait a minute. Did you just take some... Oh. Oh, I'm... Yeah, I took it, old man. Hey, it's mine now! And I'll make good use of it. Believe you me! <laughs> what a non -ball. We'll let him use it. Hey, thanks. It'll help, Pops. So how's the boy? Poor kid. He sure got the worst of whatever it was. 
Sure hope he gets better soon. Right now is where when he really needs to hold on and not give up. It's amazing he recovered when they carried him after here after they uh, first discovered him. I thought he was sure for sure a goner. That boy must have been must have one powerful guardian guardian angel watching over him. I sure must have some powerful demon controlling my tongue, not letting me speak English. Gather round, gather round, this is a bargain. We got the best armor and weapons, the likes of which you won't find anywhere else. But it's first come, first serve, so get yours now. Step right up. You there, don't just stand around outside. Come on in. Go on in. Come on, don't be shy, step right up. I'll never know why he wanted to open a store in a dead town like this. What's with him? Ugh. Welcome to the charity store. Store of love and courage. What can I get you today? Uh, yes. Am cannon. Crystal comb. Oh, I finally have a better weapon. Crystal cross. Crystal M phone. Oh, I don't have enough money. Shit. <laughs> All right, I guess I gotta sell something. I might actually sell this lightning. Yeah. But I still I still need more. Oh no, not much time left! You never know when that moon's gonna come crashing down! When it all comes down to it, this world's about money and material things. If you got them, you can get them whenever. Wherever! Gotta buy, gotta buy, buy, buy. I'm gonna shop till I drop. Oh good, someone must have locked it. Look for the weapon store behind... There's a white chocobo. You can now... Since you can now control high wind, you can go to the chocobo farm where you can buy Mehmet greens. Look for the door at the back of the weapon shop, it's locked. Head to the wooden head to the wooden bridge, but there's a man in purple. Examine the ground until you find a beat up useless old key. Head to the back of the head back to the weapon store to the locked door and the owner of the shop will question Tifa what she's doing. Choose tell the truth, and the owner will give you the curse ring. Can I still get that? Because I even though I don't have Tifa? kid got a green stone from that chocobo. I'm so jealous! Hey, I know what'll do it. Let's try that beat-up old key. Use it. Yeah, this is it. Huh? What? Won't turn? What? Ooh, shit. Busted it. Can't get the damn thing out. Something wrong. Uh, no. No, uh, I... Damn, this is bad. What the hell? Lie. Just apologize and get it over with. Sorry, I twisted the I twisted the shit and it broke. 
Is that key? You made the one on the, the one to that door? <laughs> That's a good one. Huh? Of course there's no key. It's a wall. We just painted a door on it. Say what? Say what? You drew that door on the wall? That's right. We drew it there to make it feel like you could pass through into another world. Sorry to surprise you. Not much of an apology, but please take this. Oh, uh, well, thanks. <laughs> Cursed ring. We're hoping to pass through a door like that one into another world. I feel like... I feel that you all might be able to make my dreams come true. Weird, isn't it? Alright, I've got to sell something else. What do I have a ton of? Oh, that's not worth it. Might as well sell those. Never use those. I hate these things that just cost nothing. This stuff is worth anything. <laughs> uh, nope, tissues. I could sell all my old weapons and shit. I don't know. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. What else have I got? Tetra element. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Alright, well, at least I have some money now. I got six of these guys. Two whole things. Nah, it's time to it's time to upgrade for sure. <laughs> Micro laser. Wait, drains half fire cold. No, I want you to have... Yeah, I don't want you to drain half. I want you to have all of it.
Yeah, that's good. What do we got here? This is Missify? Eh. I can give him an all. Added effect. Poison. All. Lightning. What else can I give you? Give the enemy skill. Preemptive. Looks like Barret's got a whole bunch of alls. <laughs> um, item. Range. Do I have anything else that we can be considered a, uh... No, I'm gonna save these. This is for... Okay, that's, that's for red. Gigantic, no. You say you don't know when the stars are going to fall from the sky? Is that for real? I still don't believe it. How could this happen? Ancient weapon, end of the world, malarkey! I'm going to live to be a hundred. Yeah, only because we're going to save the world. There's still tons of stuff I gotta do. This is just the beginning! What have Shinra and Soldier done about it? Tell me, they're useless. Actually, I'm a beautiful maid. I only work on, in this accessory store part-time. Our goods compare with the best goods anywhere, so how about one? Huh. Fuck. Yeah, I actually like that I have already got one of everything. Alright, so weapon store, it's locked. Beat up old uses key. Get the curse ring. Um, go to the clinic. After Tifa decides its name of the cloud, update your party, weapons, and other equipment. Afterward, head back to Medeal and investigate the house where Tifa talked to the dog earlier. Pick up an elixir on the bed. From here, head to Mount Corel to continue the story. Oh, that's it. <clears throat> this section's done. I guess. We're actually speeding up towards the end of the game, I think. Which is fun. She's always there, right by his side. She must really love him. Even at a time like this, you should never give up hope. You've got to be the str you've got to be strong like her. Well, anyway, help. Hey, you all look terrible. Why don't you get some rest? <laughs> you guys look like shit. Sleep. So that way you can look better. Okay, perfect. Well, then take care. I'm sorry, but your friend's condition remains unchanged. You'll have to be patient and wait this out. Things like this take time. Just like fine wine, time is of the essence. Cloud, well, I don't understand a word. Such a fool. I thought I could help. I thought I could do something to help. Ugh. Ugh. What? What number am I? What number am I? <clears throat> do 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 do. All right, head to Mount Corel. Shit, I need my map again. North Corel, Material Cave, also. Or Nibelheim, Material Cave. I like how they label everything except for Mount Corel. I know where it is, it's fine.
Wait, can I land here? Oh. Shinner soldiers came by, came around saying that they were gathering up all the huge materia. I think they're going to bring it here, right by Coltrane, from the Corel reactor. Some Shinner soldiers went up to Mount Corel. They said they're collecting huge materia to blow up Meteor. Yeah, I think you think they can really do it. I bet the reactor destroys everything even before the meteor hits. Oh god, it's been forever since we've been here. <laughs> like, what's the, what's the point of making you walk all the way across that? I like that. I love his new gun. That looks so cool. Let's speed it up a bit, though, shall we? Got places to be. Fishes to see. Dude, I just maxed out damage on one of those. <laughs> nice. God, I spent so much time here grinding for the 300 grand. You guys are here to kick your fucking ass. I like lightly poked him with my spear. Guess we're safe for now. But oh, wait! Damn! <laughs> Looks like they're taking off with the huge materia in that train! No. Damn boneheads! What are you gonna do? Huge materia! Hey, do you know who I am? I'm Sid. That's who the hell I am. Now just let me handle this. Hey, 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 hey! But if we're going down the track, aren't we going back down the track where, um... There's, like, holes in the track. Pretty good for an old guy. I'm impressed you can move this thing. Don't ask me. I don't know. 
What? You serious? Don't worry, I can handle this. Two levers, one on the right, one on the left. I see, I just alternate the two levers up and down, right? Judging from the enemy's speed, I'd say it'll take about 10 minutes. We're gonna fly. Hold on tight. Is this really what I have to do? Sorry, I need to check on that. Uh, steal from Eagle Gun when battling on the train, Warrior Bengal. Ultimate Materia, obtained from the townspeople after you stop the train, obtained after talking to a woman in the leftmost house in North Corral. Okay. Uh, there's a trigger an event that ends with you trying to catch a train carrying huge materia. There is a 10 minute timer for this mission. You have to catch up to the train and retrieve the materia. This is done by controlling the train with the following instructions. Okay, so it's, it's literally just this. Okay. I'm guessing watching, watching the other track. All right, we're gonna jump. That's highly unlikely they made that jump. All right, so it says to steal. Steal from Eagle Gun when battling on the train. Okay, Eagle Gun. I've got to figure out who Eagle Gun is. It's a gas ductor. This is not Eagle Gun. I knew one of them had a, like an all cure sort of thing going on. I just didn't know who it was. This is the one. It has to be. This has to be Eagle Gun. There we go. 
like, this has to be it. It looks like an eagle. And it's got guns for wings, so... Of course it. Of course it is. Kind of a cool enemy. I kind of, I kind of dig it. <laughs> Dynamite game. What the? You, you guys! Alright, hand over the huge materia. Shit! Whoa! What's this fucking guy gonna do? Guts coming after me. I'll never forget you. No time for that now. Forget the huge material. We're, we're the ones in deep trouble. Now already, just shut up and sit tight. If we keep this up, we'll crash right into North Corral. Let's see if we use the levers alternately to accelerate. It should stop if we move the levers up or down simultaneously. We're doing accelerating. Shit, the other way. I'll just just watch. I'll. Hey, hey, hey! It's serious, you old man. Uh, you need to press both up and triangle and down at the same time. Depending on the prompt, if you're successful, the train will eventually stop. Need to press both the up and triangle and down and X buttons at the same time. Depending on the prompt, if you're successful, the train will stop eventually. I didn't realize I did it. Received key item, huge materia. Okay. Right, somebody else has got materia for me. You sure are brave, I'm impressed. Are the ones that stopped that Shinra train? The Shinra was just about to destroy our lives again! Might be full of junk, but this is the only home we got, Barrett. Of, of course, we're all born and raised in the coal mines. No matter how tough it gets, our hearts burn bright like bright red like coal. To hell with Meteor, we're coal miners, ain't we? We'll dig a deep tunnel and hide from the Meteor. That's it. Hey, kid! How about giving something to these guys fighting the Shinra? Got it out of the wall. Isn't it an amazing rock? Ultima. He must have been... Must have been a horrific battle. You have scars all over your body. I already talked to the end's owner. Today you can rest for free. Well, isn't that there nice of them? Nope. I already had my fill. It wasn't that hurt anyway. Hey, what's a meteor? 
Peter really gonna crash down on us? I'm still too young. I'll never remarry. This memento is all I have left of my husband. I'll give it to you. If, if you'll please stop me, dear. Catastrophe? What, what is catastrophe? It's not Meteor. Or, I mean, it's not, uh... Nice! Okay. I was saying, it's not, it's not Materia. Yeah, Sid needs to get better at his limit breaks. Okay. Are we done here? Uh, you need press up. Turn to the high wind and head to Fort Condor. All right, cool. I think we're finishing off that plot line. <clears throat> Reward for defeating CMD Grand Horn. Located on the ground after exiting the watch room through the path that leads to the top of the mountain for Condor Item Shop. Okay. Go to the entrance of the Fort Condor and talk to the man blocking the way. He will ask you to help defending his fort. Uh, head down the pathway to reach a man sitting at a table, talk to him, learn about the area's history, claim the letter, and reach the watch room. Once inside the watch room, we can peek out the window to see Condor roosting atop the reactor. This is all old stuff. You can either head to battle without hiring additional soldiers or learn to avoid paying for help. Otherwise, you can hire soldiers to assist you with against the advancing Shinra forces. Eventually you'll find yourself in a boss battle against Commander Grand Horn, depending on your level. You can handily defeat this boss since he only has 8,000 HP. After the battle, go through the doorway and outside the washroom. Yeah, I mean, we're basically done here. We should just be basically at the, the boss. The situation has changed. Looks like the enemy is set to attack. If we lose, it's over. Our lives are in your hands. We're counting on you. Okay, we're ready. This is a deciding battle. The enemy numbers more than ever before. Let's give him all the kill we have. Gee, I wonder what my strategy is.
Let's make him go fast. Anybody not moving? I don't want to watch you. Fucking army of catapults. Can you move out of the way so that I can build, like, another, uh, catapult, please? Uh, 
I don't need that repair. Almost there. <laughs> Just fuck him up. Yes, we did it. That was wonderful. Thank you. I doubt Shinra will attack now. just now the condor the egg what would you go outside see what it was yeah but see phoenix <laughs> it looks so goofy Gone. 
Be sure to report to my father, too. Everyone, thanks. I mean it. Thanks. Although there isn't anything we can give you, we'll make sure we, you can stop in and stay at any time. So be sure to drop by. Yes, yes, and there's one more thing I forgot to tell you. See the key item, huge materia. Huh? What's this? <gasps> What's this? Damn, man, it's huge materia. Gotta have that materia. The truth is, this is mater the materia inside the reactor. What the hell did we fight for? We weren't protecting the reactor, we were protecting the Condor. When the reactor was built, they forced us to help. That's how I knew what was inside the reactor. I knew this day would come, so after Shinra left, I sneaked in and took the materia. I don't, didn't mean to fool you, but I guess that's how it ended up. I'm really sorry. Just forget about it. Anyway, we're still alive. I see, if you put it that way, we're really grateful. So, the last huge materia that Shinra's after is in the uh, underwater reactor in Junon. We gotta get there first and beat him to no matter what. But you know, Shinra will probably be on higher alert. Since we always mess with him. How about we take a break for a bit and go see that little fella for a bit? He must be in Cloud. Yeah, I'm worried about Tifa. She may have collapsed taking care of the guy. Don't know about checking in on him. How about checking in on him? Down and down to Medeal. Okay. By this game guide, we are one, two, three, four, five, six things away uh, from being at the end. There's not much left in either of them. It's just cool. We've been playing this game for how long now? Forty-two hours. Okay, I've done more in the forty-two hours here playing this than I did in like the less than forty hours, like almost forty hours I did when I like ran through the game the first time. Okay, uh... Medeal. It's no use. I don't understand a thing. Cloud. What should I do? What if you never recover for the rest of your life? Yeah! Coming. They're coming. Was it? What did you say, Cloud? Ugh. Damn, what the hell's going on? Oh shit, wasn't I using, like, another guy entirely?
Uh, watch the clinic and talk to Tifa after this Ultima weapon attacks Medeal, so it's time for a boss fight. <laughs> Ultima, we Ultima weapon is kind of a chicken uh, weapon, so it fails from the fight regardless what you do. Survive a few fights and try to steal a curse ring from it. Okay. What's this? The live stream is gushing up from below the surface of the earth. Damn, that this is bad. Sid, what's wrong? Uh, nothing. You and Cloud get inside quick. But I. Hey, don't worry about a thing. I ain't about to die that easily. Be careful. Okay, here we go. Watch this. Damn, that fucking weapon. All the times to show up. Okay then. <laughs> okay then. Okay then. Come on, you asshole. This thing is supposed to be like way more fucking massive than this, right? Cool, that's it. Now we just fucking attack the shit out of it. There are two of them in the game, so this is the second. Cast Big Guard. I don't think I have that. So this isn't like a battle that I can win. like battles that you don't win because you don't usually get experience from them either. You asshole, you're trying to escape! I swear next time that guy's dead meat. Looks like the live stream settled down now too. Damn, you gotta be kidding. This is bad. The main stream is kicking up. Something way bigger than that last one is on its way. No good. Get out of here. Eventually, I'll be running around with Tifa's memories. Finish the first time I've ever What about Tifa and Cloud? God damn it. We don't have time to worry about anyone other than ourselves. Than yourself. Don't know what that stream will blow. Whoa! There's no time. Hurry! Tifa, Cloud, get out of here! Oh god, the tremors are getting worse. Wait a minute, Cloud. Doctor, shouldn't we move him somewhere? Uh, it might be safer to move to an open area. Don't you worry about a thing, Cloud. I'll see to it that you get somewhere safe. Oh, the structure can't take it. Hurry! S. S. Yes! Ready, Cloud? We're leaving now. Oh my god, that's so fucking funny. Little chibi Tifa and Cloud running away. <laughs> oh, 
Looks like you're going to spend some more time in that live stream. Where am I? What's happening? I... Where's Cloud? Cloud, where are you? Huh? What? Who? Who is it? I can't hear. Wait a minute. I know nothing about that! That's not me. I'd never do anything like that. No, stop it! Stay back! Somebody help, please help! Cloud, help me! this it's the item and weapon level up screen from uh, the remake <laughs> basically is this inside one of your dreams or is it your subconscious you're searching aren't you cloud searching for yourself I can help too we'll work together to try to get your real get the real you back where do we start? The gates of Nibelheim five years ago. Sephiroth passed through these gates. And that's how it all started. Connects to Nibelheim? That's right. It's probably best to start from there. Let's go have a look, Cloud. I know it's not easy. I'll be here for you. Look. Here's the well. That's Gramps in too. The only truck in town. It's been here since we were little kids, right? This is Nibelheim, you remember, right? It's the same as my Nibelheim. That's why this is our Nibelheim. Five years ago, two men from Soldier came. Sephiroth and a young, vibrant soldier. Can you tell me again what happened? How does it feel? Five years ago, I saw the real Sephiroth for the very first time. It's your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? So how does it feel? I wouldn't know because I don't have a hometown. Um, how about your parents? This is the great Sephiroth. My mother is Genova. She died right after he gave birth to me. My father. But to tell you the truth, I thought he was very cold. What does it matter? Alright, let's go. I remember the a foreboding about him.
No, Cloud. <clears throat> I've been hiding it for some time, I'm afraid that if I told you something terrible might happen. But I'm not going to hide anything anymore. You weren't here. Cloud did not come to Nibelheim five years ago. I waited, but Cloud never came. The two that were ordered here were Sephiroth and another person. You mean that member of Soldier who came with Sephiroth wasn't Cloud? There's nothing I can say. You must find the answer yourself. If you can't, then. Take your time, Cloud. Slowly. Little by little, okay? That starry night at the well, and our promises, what if the memory was all just a lie? Don't hurry, Cloud. Don't answer too quickly. Just keep checking all those small emotions, and it'll come back slowly, little by little. Right, like the sky that night. The heavens were filled with stars. From the beginning, okay. Ryan, remember Cloud. I was wearing these clothes. That's you too. You were so small then. And cute. Sephiroth once said, Cloud made up his memories by listening to my stories. Did you imagine the sky? Do you remember it? No, no, you remembered it. That night, the stars were gorgeous. It was just Cloud and I. We talked at the well. That's why I kept thinking you were the real Cloud. I still believe you're the clown from Nibelheim. But you don't believe in yourself. These memories aren't enough. Dad, what about your other memories? No, not memories. A memory is something that can that is consciously recalled, right? That's why sometimes it can be mistaken or wrong. It's different from a memory, locked deep within your heart. That's why it must be a fake if you could recall up that memory. That's it. What about some memory that has to do with me? If I say something, can, you can't remember it. But if you say something and I remember it, too, then we'll know it, that's a memory. Talk to me about anything. Some more important memory to you. Now that you mention it, why did you want to join a soldier in the first place? Always thought it was a sudden decision. I was devastated. I wanted to be noticed. I thought if I got stronger, someone would notice me. Or notice. Someone to notice you? Who? Who? You know who. You. That's who. You. Me. Why? 
Tifa, did you forget about those days? Look, I... I'm sorry, but what are you talking about? No, it's all right. You were having a hard time back then. You were so busy with your own things, it's only natural you don't remember me then. Then? It's important to me. I hate to say it, but it's a very important memory. Do you want to see it? Come on, hurry. Come on, hurry. Build up secret wish. Tender memories no one can ever know. Tender memories. Do you know where this window goes, Tifa? Fine, I'll go. I was staring at you from your window. My room? It was my first time there. Was it? I only used to look up at it from outside. Hey, look! Clouds coming! You think he wants to come in? That was the first day you came into my room? That's right. We lived next to each other, but I really didn't know you that well. I've known you since we were children, and I always thought we were close. <laughs> look, look, look. Now that you mention it, I don't recall you ever being in my room. Tifa always used to have her own group. That's right. I thought they were all stupid. What? You were all childish, laughing at every little stupid thing. But we were children then. I know, I was the stupid one. I really wanted to play with everyone, but you never let me in the group. Then later I started thinking I was different. That I was different from those immature kids. That then maybe... Just maybe they would invite me in. I thought that might happen, so I hung around. I was so prejudiced and weak. That night I asked Tifa to come out to the well. I thought to myself Tifa would never come, that she hated me. It was so sudden, I was a bit surprised. But... It's true we weren't that close, but... After you left town, I really thought a lot about you. I used to wonder how Cloud was doing. I wondered if you were able to get into Soldier. I started reading the newspapers thinking I might see an article about you. Thanks, Tifa. Tell him what you told me later. He'll probably be so happy. Okay. Huh? What happened on this day? Was it a special day? This was the day. Eva's mother. A mom died. I want to see mom. I wonder if there's anything beyond the mountain. Mount Nibble is scary. Many people have died there. No one crosses the mount that mountain alive. 
How about those that died? Did Mama pass through that mountain? I'm going. Them just ditching Tifa. I don't remember the path I walked. If I missed her step, I ran to her, but I didn't make it in time. We both fell off the cliff. Back then, I was only, I only scarred my knees, but. Why'd you bring Tifa to a place like this? What the hell's the matter with you? What if she dies? Tifa was in a coma for seven days. We all thought she wouldn't make it. If only I could have saved her. I was so angry at myself for my weakness. Ever since then, I felt Tifa blamed me. I went out of control. I get into fights with anyone. That was the first time I'd heard about Sephiroth. I thought if I were strong like Sephiroth, then... If I could just get stronger, then even Tifa would have to notice me. So that was it. Sorry, Cloud. If I had only remembered more clearly what happened, I could have done something sooner. It's not your fault, Tifa. But I remember back when we were eight. That's it. Now I know. You weren't created five years ago. My childhood memories weren't all made up. Just hang in there, Cloud. Just a little longer. You've almost found the real you. Let's go back to Nibelheim again. The truth is right there. We almost have the answer right in the palm of our hands. Cloud, oh, wait. Where are you going? The reactor? To the reactor, to the Mako reactor, of five years ago. Hey, it's Cloud! Zack, you remembered! That's right, it was Zack who came to Nibelheim with Sephiroth. 
Then where were you, Cloud? Cloud, did you see it all? I saw everything. Yarg, who, who are you? Mom, thief of my town, give it back! I had so much respect for you. I admired you. Cloud? That's what happened. You were there. You were watching me. Yeah, I remember. Huh, so it was you. Hey, Clown, if you're feeling sick, why don't you take that mask off? Yeah. Yeah, this is me. I never made it as a member of Soldier. I even left my hometown telling everyone I was going to join, but... I'm so embarrassed. I didn't want to see anybody. How does it feel? It's your first time back home to your back to your hometown in a long time, right? I'm You came. You kept your promise. So you really did come when I was in trouble. Sorry, I didn't get there sooner. It's alright, Cloud. Just like you. Cloud, kill Sephiroth! Sephiroth! Don't push it. It can't be. No. So he stabbed Cloud and he and Cloud took him and threw him with his stabbed body. <laughs> beast. 
cloud. Then this is goodbye, Tifa, until we meet again. Huh? Cloud! Uh, uh, uh. I've got all of my polygons back! Uh, Tifa? Oh, Cloud, it's really you, isn't it? Yeah, Tifa, we finally meet again. We finally meet again. You stupid jerk, you had us all worried sick. Cloud, are you all right? The voice there. I see. We're in the live stream, aren't we? Everyone's waiting. Let's go back, Cloud. Back to everyone. Yeah, I guess so. Come on, Tifa. Let's go home. I like Superman. Yo, you all right, Tifa? Uh, um... Barrett, you came back. I... Cloud, where is he? Don't worry about him, he's a tough one. Barrett, I... When I was in the live stream, I saw the real Cloud. I mean, I didn't really find him. Cloud, he found himself. All right, I know. I shouldn't have doubted. But I can't win against you. You're some kind of lady. People have so many things pent up inside of themselves. So many things they can never forget. Strange, isn't it? Yo, Tifa, snap out of it! Tifa! Tifa! Everyone, I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. Don't say anything, Cloud. You've... All you've been doing is apologizing. I never was in Soldier. I made up the story about what happened five years ago and my being in Soldier. I left my village looking for glory, but I never made it into Soldier. I was so ashamed of being so weak. Then I heard my, the story from my friend Zack. And I created an illusion of myself. I made up, made up of what I'd seen in my life. I continued to play the, the charade as if it were true. Illusion, huh? Pretty damn strong for an illusion. Physically, I'm built like someone in Soldier. Hojo's plan to clone Sephiroth wasn't that difficult. It was just the same procedure they use when creating members of Soldier. You see, someone in Soldier isn't simply exposed to Mako energy. Their bodies are actually injected with Genova, Genova cells. Shells. Uh, for better or worse, there's only the strong can enter soldier. That has nothing to do with the Genova reunion, but weak people like me get lost in the whole thing. Combination of Genova shells, <laughs> Genova sh 
cells. I, why do I want to say that as shells? Sephiroth's strong will and my own weakness are what created me. Everyone knew that. I'm Cloud. The master of my own illusionary world. But I can't remain trapped in an illusion anymore. I'm going to live my life without pretending. <laughs> you sure messed up, Cloud. <laughs> that means he ain't no different from before. By the way, Cloud, what are we going to do now? Don't tell me you're going to leave the ship. I'm the reason why Meteor is falling towards us. That's why I have to do everything in my power to fight this thing. Good. Then you're going to keep fighting to save the planet? It's like you always told me, Barrett. Oh, uh, you mean that? I, I don't understand. There ain't no getting off of this train. <laughs> uh, camaraderie. Hooray. The deal's destroyed, and the shops won't have much left to offer you. However, the crazy customer on the right part of the area has the items the shops used to have. If you talk to her during, in the corresponding shops, that is. If you talk to her in just the weapon shop, that's all you'll be able to buy. Well, I don't really need to buy anything, do I? God, I was deeply moved by your story. I'm really a weak person, and so I could really understand how you feel, Cloud. No one knows when fighting will begin, but let's get ready. You know what? Let's go Barret and Tifa. Listen, Cloud. We're right in the middle of the mission for the huge materia, right? I know this is kind of out of the blue, but Junon has an underwater reactor. As far as I can see, that's the only one left. That's that. Let's go. Ah, uh, yeah. Definitely taking that. Oh, damn, Warrior Bangle. Bolt Armlet, Roar Armlet, Fire, Four Slots, Giga, Inco. All right, what does Cloud get? Elemental. Give him ice. Ultima. Ah, shit. I'm gonna have to take things off of everybody. Um... Let's go, like, remove all material from everybody.
Oh shit, I don't have any more. Hey, you can have that, that's fine. <laughs> Remove. Winchester Dragon. Yeah, he, you're fine. We're just, I think we're just going to stick with this team for right now. Uh, okay. Alright. Uh, oof. Bout needs a few things. Definitely counterattack. Preemptive. Give him cover. Enemy skill. All right, I'm going to give. I'm still going to give him ice. Alright, and then... Added cut. Ultima. Comet, Rucked, my God, so many all. I give him a Neo Bahamut and Phoenix. Now for you. Speed. Long range. Sense. Steel. Elemental Fire Earth All Gravity Alexander and Kajuta. All right, we're gonna keep doing the same sort of same sort of style here. Uh, you, Kajuta. 
We get luck plus, HP plus, and hmm. Magic plus? Bahamut and Leviathan is what you're going to get. up here oh yeah I'm gonna give him an elemental want his to be the lightning also I want to give you Full cure, maybe? That's right, Tifa doesn't have her final limit break yet. Tifa final limit break. It's uh, re restore for one, and save for two. I got my team. Come on, Cloud, don't fuck around. We're going to Junon. He's a level eight now. Want to go? He's not scared anymore. This, this here is Mandil. As you can see, this used to be quite a hot springs town. Everything's gone now, but in a way, I'm kind of glad. Everything's cleaned out. Feels better this way. Ho, ho. Hey, you feeling all better now? That's good. Real good. Now, don't overdo yourself like that again, you hear? Isn't the live stream a strange thing? When I die, I wonder if I'll float along in the middle of a warm, gentle stream like this. Welcome, we always welcome Cash. What can I do for you today? Oh, it's just an item shop? Okay. Didn't it say that the girl that was buying all the stuff would be here to buy things?
<laughs> you? How did you get over the, your maca poisoning? It's absolutely amazing. I'm so glad for you. Looks like your friend's wishes came true. You can see for yourself what things are like, but at least no one was seriously hurt. We're very, just very unhappy now. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome. It's here. The day's finally come. Your day to shop. Do we have items and weapons? Well, I should say. And here's a bargain. What would you say to 50% off everything? Just kidding. I wouldn't, even I wouldn't do that. Now what can I do for you today? I just want two of those. Okay. There are a few optional things that you can do at this point. First of all, head to Bone Village. Ask for a search, doesn't matter what, except no Luna Harp, duh. Now just skip placing diggers and planting bombs and walk to the upper level here. Stand near the ledge and in between you'll receive in between the smoke and campfire. Mark the spot. The next morning grab key. Key to sector five? Oh. Why don't we do some extra things? So I have to go to Bone Forest, okay. Or the Bone, Bone whatever. The Bone Zone. I don't remember where this is. Bone Village, okay. Dig in. Uh, good treasure. Okay, so it says... Then near the ledge, in the middle of the smoke and the campfire. Is there a reason why we couldn't do this earlier? I mean, nothing in here. I didn't mean to actually set a person.
Okay. Fun. You can complete the key to Sector 5 quest and re-enter Midgar slums anytime after Cloud rejoins your party. Those that have attempted travel Midgar quickly realize that the gate back to Sector 5 is locked. The man standing outside the gate mentions he thinks he lost his key while on an activation tour. Wait, do I have to talk to him first? I guess, like, game-wise, that would make sense, right? That I had to talk to this dude first before I could go back? That's funny, I dropped a key to this gate. Somewhere must have been on that excavation tour. Alright, let's try that again! So this one says here. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, the key sector fight can be found near the smashed up plane on the main level of the dig site. Use a screenshot to help guide you. Maybe one of these. Fantastic. All right, so guess where we're going. We might be lucky enough to see a glitch. Hey, 
Okay, we're back in. see here. If you go to the church, you can witness a glitch on Eris. Head to the wall market. Go to the stores and say, item in here. Try to use the machine to receive the premium heart. That Tifa's ultimate weapon. Funny scene will happen if you have Sid and Tifa in your party. Birdie. Hey, where's the flower lady? She dead. I guess no glitch for us. Oh well. Alright, so it says that there's a thing if you have Sid and Tifa. Well, let's do that. There's almost no point in finding these guys. Except for the tiny bit of gold. Well, market. Hey, about your daughter. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, let me see that. It should work now. Go on, try it now. Sid, what did you do? Don't get mad. I just get more wrinkles. Hey, something's coming out. See, premium heart. That was a funny scene. Oh, dude. Yes.
Okay, cool. Uh, now head to the weapon store up north under the guy who sold you batteries and he'll offer you a new bargain. Uh, cough, sucker, cough. He'll sell you the sneak glove for a whopping 129000 It's a great item, though, is it increases your stealing chances a lot. So you can't get around... So you can't get around it if you want to have it. When you have this, exit Midgar again, or you can go to... Go on a massacre and waste, girl, waste all the weak enemies around here that used to bother you before. <laughs> well, I definitely don't have 129,000. However... Pretty sure that I can make 129 grand appear. How much money would I need? <laughs> Alright, I'm pretty sure I don't have to worry about money. Anymore. Oh, so you're back. I got something good for you. Why don't you buy it? You probably just found it lying around somewhere, right? I'll admit that I found it, but you may never be able to get another one like, it, like this again. I'm at 129,000 gil for it. All right. Hey, much obliged. You'll never regret it. Okay, I have it. I probably don't need it, but I have it. And that's really all that matters, isn't it? Bam, bam, Let's bolt out of here. <laughs> as fast as we can while getting stuck on basically everything. Okay, so now we go to Nibelheim, which is
I need to find the keys. this melody somewhere before. I played it well. I have the sheet music for that song. Hey, wait a minute. There's something inside the sheet music. Tifa, what's happened to our town? Was it just an illusion or just a dream? No, it was neither. I remember trying to get people out of the flames, but not having the strength burning with anger, I went to the reactor to kill Sephiroth. But he was nowhere to be found. Instead, I found you, collapsed inside. I felt saving you was far more important than going after Sephiroth. There were several others that were still alive inside, but I was only able to save you. As I was coming out of the reactor, Shinra troops were just arriving. I recall a scientist named Hojo was in charge. He ordered the troops to gather up everyone still alive for the experiment. I didn't know what type of experiment he was talking about, but I wasn't about to let them have my dearest student. Putting you on my back, I headed down the mountain to the village. I used the cure spell on you many times and started to head for Midgar to look for a doctor for you. I didn't like that city and my cure spells weren't helping. I decided to go to Midgar to find a doctor I can trust. I'm worried about you, but I can't settle down in one place for very long. Have you fully recovered? Are you well? I wonder how many years have passed since then. I just got into town again, but I can't believe it. The whole town is back to normal. Except for the strange people with black clothes all around. The town reeks of Shinra, but I won't go after them. You may think I'm running from them, but it's not but it's just that I don't want anything to do with Shinra anymore. Feels like time is running out. I'll make sh I'm sure you'll find this letter and this gift for you. It should come in handy. I can't even jump anymore. But I hope you continue to sharpen your skills and remember what I taught you. To my most precious student from Zangan. To see final heaven. <laughs> she just had to do like a little, a little, a little demonstration. Final heaven for Tifa. Nice. Okay, what's next? Uh, Gold Saucer has reopened, which means you can do chocobo races now and also breed chocobos again. I won't go in depth here. More info, info in the special. You can get four special material caves. I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> Optional 7 through 16, what? Okay, well, apparently we can do like chocobo breeding and shit now. Which there are special materia caves that we can go to. I just don't know if I want to do those. Oh no. 
Because other, otherwise, it's it's over to the underwater reactor. Let's see here. I want to find out where you're getting like FF ultimate weapons. I want to find out like who and where I need to go to see all those. Cloud has the ultimate weapon. Uh, one of the strongest weapons in the in the game can be cannot be acquired until he returns to the party after the events of Medeal. The player needs to pursue the boss known as Ultimate Weapon across the world in a manner of reminiscent of the Death Gaze, Chalice from Final Fantasy VI. Okay, so I need to chase a weapon. Uh, you can follow the Ultimate Weapon across the skies. The player needs to keep crashing the High Wind into Ultimate Weapon. Which will cause it to flee to different locations of the world map. Each fight with the ultimate weapon ends after a few rounds. So we'll run away from battle. Maybe I'll do that. Once players dealt enough damage to the ultimate weapon, we'll fight a Cosmo Canyon for one last battle. Alright, let's let's fucking do that. I should be able to do it. I'm in the right section. I have retrieved cloud back from Madil. I was gonna do some smash tonight. I might still, I don't know. It's Saturday, I can do whatever the fuck I want. It's like 100 degrees outside. So I'm not doing anything out there. No fucking movies today. All right, so I guess we just have to find a weapon. I could just like cross the world like this, just at like a slight angle, and eventually just see everything. I remember uh, when I was playing Skies of Arcadia, um, a lot of shit like this, just going back and forth all over the map. Yeah, and I really want to know how you're supposed to, like, fucking land here. Weapon, weapon, where are you? Like, seriously. Where the fuck are you, man? Just to make sure, it's like not already here, right?
Oh, I know what's going on here. <laughs> it's the elements that I have attached to their weapons. Maybe I should change that. Yeah, I think I'm just going to give him an all. That way I don't have to worry about their weapons being super weakened by random things. Okay. After diamond weapons defeat. So it looks like we have some things to do. Because it says after f after diamond weapons defeat. Diamond weapon is a boss in Final Fantasy VII, one of the planet's many weapons. Party fights it as it approaches Midgard towards the end of the game. Its attacks include a foot stomp. Okay, so it actually says that there's a couple places where it could be. Shit, I went out the other side. <laughs> I went out the other side. Peacock on me and live to tell about it. It should hopefully go a lot differently. Uh, the answer is no, apparently. Alright, so there's Midgar. Just gonna check all these items or all these areas. Fort Condor is one of them. Midgar is another. Corel's another. Nibel and Mount Nibel are another. 
than the North Crater. Which is a big no. Yeah, it's definitely not available yet. Oh, God damn it. Which means that we have to go to Junon. Fuck's Juno. <laughs> there we go. Alright, this is where we end. This is where we end it. Okay. We'll do this some more the next time <laughs> and have more fun. I mean, we're getting close. We're like really legitimately getting close. Which is exciting. Mm. Name carry armor. We're starting to get to a point where, like, um, the level that I am is not going to mean much for very long, so we might need to do a little bit of grinding. That's fine. Okay, let's end this one here. <laughs>